Magandang araw muli sa inyong lahat. Welcome sa ating channel. Sa araw na ito ay sana namang self-evaluation ang ating gagawin dito sa subject na Forensic Chemistry and Toxicology. Okay, so answer it properly and submit sa link na makikita sa ating description box. Later on, ilalagay din natin sa ating description box yung mga key answers nito. Okay, so kung handa na kayo, let's start to question number one. What is the outmost covering of the hair? It consists of one layer of non-nucleated polygonal cells which overlaps like the scales on a fish. Letter A, cortex. Letter B, cuticle. Letter C, medulla. Or letter D, core. Let's proceed to question number two. What is the chemical that is responsible for the color of the hair? Letter A, melanin. Letter B, paraben. Letter C, formaldehyde. Or letter D, phthalates. Question number three. Referring to the relationship between the diameter of the medulla and the diameter of the whole hair. Letter A, Medullary index, letter B, cuticle index, letter C, melanin index, or letter D, cortex index. Let's proceed to question number four. If the investigator was able to recover the hair in the crime scene and it is noted that the pigment is missing or is starting to disappear in the hair, what is your initial conclusion on the matter? Letter A, hair is from animal. Letter B, hair is from adult person. Letter C, hair is from minor person. Or letter D, hair is not from human or animals. Question number five. What is the frequently used to determine the general group to which a fibers or fiber belongs. It is not reliable for positive identification of fiber. A. Microscopic examination. Letter B. Visual test. Letter C. Physical test. Or letter D. Lorenz test. Question number six. One of the earliest substance used for writing. It is from the name papyrus that the word paper was derived letter a egyptian papyrus letter b american papyrus letter c chinese papyrus or letter d american papyrus question number seven what test is not usually used in the examination of paper letter a preliminary examination letter b Physical test causing no perceptible change. Letter C, fluorescence test. Or letter D, physical test causing a perceptible change. Question number 8. The quality of paper that does not allow light to pass through or which prevents dark objects from being seen to the paper. Letter A, opacity. Letter B, watermarks. Letter C, wire marks. Or letter D, tire marks. Number 9. Chemical test for paper. Letter A, pictic acid. Millions region. Letter B, stannic chloride or iodine. Letter C, solution. Or letter D, staining test. Number 10, hair with narrow medulla. Letter A, belongs to human. Letter B, belongs to animals. Letter C, belong to minor. Or letter D, none of them. Okay, so hanggang dito na lamang yung ating mga sinagawang self-evaluation sa araw na ito. Submit your answer not later than 5 o'clock this afternoon. Alright, so hanggang sa muli, maraming salamat. See you again next meeting.